You know what's the best part? You don't have to know how to code. You don't have to know anything at all. And even better, you don't have to pay for a certain course. I know there's a lot of people just trying to sell you courses on new things and that is the problem. How can you expect that when a new tool comes out, that there's already some person there who's an expert in it and that they can just sell courses now? It's better to save that money. And yeah, don't fall for it. And hey, Abacus AI is only $10, only $10. Don't get me wrong, I'm not affiliating for them. You can just Google for it like this. It's gonna be the first result. And this is how it's gonna look like. So this is the homepage. Now, I gotta tell you something, $10 for a lot of language models. You know, the chat GPT is only $20. I mean, the pro version is $20, only for chat GPT. While on Abacus, you got a lot more. So today I'm gonna show you. What are we gonna do? We're just gonna go through all of these LLMs and you'll meet some new feature which is called Route LLM, which knows which one of these language models is the best for your prompt. It's just amazing. And then we're gonna talk about some AI agents and of course, how we can use this to make ourselves some money. It's not a get rich quick scheme. You're not gonna get millions of dollars, but you can get yourself a really good side hustle with this one, so let's just start. So when you land on the homepage, you just have to log in. You just have to make yourself an account. You can use Google, whatever. And then I like to start with chat LLM teams. Now, why do they call it teams? Well, it's your all in one super assistant. And I really think that this is a true explanation of what this is. So this is how it's gonna look like. It looks like chat GPT, right? But have a look at this. If you click here, you've got all of these models that you can use and you can switch to DeepSeek, you can switch to Gemini, GPT-4.0 is here, DeepSeek V3, there's Claude, there's a lot of these models all in one. So it's an all in one tool. But this, if you choose Route LLM, it's gonna read your prompt and it's just gonna give you the best LLM for that purpose. So if I just to do something like this, so write me a blog post about health and it's actually healthy diet, let's just go with healthy diet and its importance, right? So I'm just gonna do it like that. And if you click on it, now if you just go, you can see Route LLM is routing this to GPT-4.0 because it thinks it's gonna give you the best result if it uses that model. You can of course change the model if you don't like it, you can use Claude, whatever, but Route LLM is such a good thing because as you can see, now this is finished, this blog post. Down there, you can regenerate using one of these here. But have a look at what happens if I do this. Now, can you generate an image that encapsulates this? And just have a look at it. Route actually did a mistake there, but never mind. It's gonna understand. Route LLM is now transferring this to Flux, right? So it just gives you this prompt. Let me just see if, if it can just work like this. So from blog post from above. And as you can see, pretty fast and pretty accurate. We wanted a blog post about healthy diet, and then we got the image with Flux, which is by far the best one now. Now this shows us that you can generate blog posts and you can generate images, SEO and everything, and you can sell that online to a lot of people. This is in demand, but this is not for everyone, right? Not everyone wants to write content for money and not everyone wants to generate images, but there is an opportunity for this one as well. But let's do something more complex and something more profitable. If I put a PDF file here, as you can see, this one is called Success with Shopify. It's just a basic information about Shopify success, whatever. But if I just do it like this, so summarize this PDF file, and I click like this, the route LLM is still gonna route this to another model, this time GPT 4.0. And as you can see, this comprehensive guide is divided into three main parts covering everything you need to know about starting, setting up, and succeeding with a Shopify e-commerce store. And that is exactly that. I read the PDF, it's correct. And of course, you got a conclusion at the bottom. But have a look at this now. Can you generate a PowerPoint presentation out of this info from PDF? So, let's see what it uses now. It uses Claude for this one. And notice it's 3.7. And of course, it's gonna generate a PowerPoint presentation just like that. And there it is. Your PPTX file is here. And here it is. It's pretty basic though, but it does the work. I mean, I haven't done anything, right? And of course, this opens up a lot of opportunities for this kind of work as well. But let's just go a bit deeper. If you switch to AI Engineer, which is located here, this is AI Engineer, this is another tool that you've got. First of all, you can create a custom chatbot 
or you can create an AI agent. This is still in the beta version, so I would just play with it and see what it can do. But create a custom chatbot is what a lot of people need nowadays. And I can just use whatever data source I want. For example, you have a client and that client needs a chatbot based on the data source they provide to you. So if you click on create a custom chatbot, it'll ask you, I'll help you to create a custom chatbot. First, I'll need a name for your chatbot. What would you like to call it? For example, let's just go with answer assistant like this. And then the best part about this one, it'll just lead you through it. It'll ask follow-up questions. You only use the natural language, which of course you will get the answers to from your client. Your client will give you the exact information of what they want. And as you can see, these are really, really expensive, right? There is a lot of demand for this one. That's the reason why they're so expensive, right? One bigger reason is that nowadays, even your local bakery needs a chatbot because people just wanna have everything online. And if they have a chatbot, they don't have to have another person employed to answer those questions, or they just wanna speed up certain processes. And it's a good thing to sell these because they offer you one more opportunity. And that is to always upsell things, right? If you do this for a flower shop, let's say, and they just wanna add all the data, all the flowers they have into that chatbot. Well, once in a while, they will add some new flowers and they will just contact you again to put those new flowers in the data set, right? I hope that makes sense. Now, Abacus will ask you to create data sets and this is what you're gonna get from your clients. So you can upload docs, you can upload PDFs, Excel sheets, whatever. You just have to click on create or attach data set. You will just upload it here. I'll use the same PDF file that I've used earlier. Just click on add data set. And then what it'll do, it'll just use that PDF file in this case to answer all future questions. So it's just like you're teaching it what to use whenever customers from that flower shop come to ask, right? So it's simple. It's not hard at all. It's just following the questions that Abacus asks you to do. In fact, anyone can do this. You just have to go there and you have to play with it for some time to gain some experience. And then it's just gonna become a natural thing to you. But the work is needed, right? Don't fall for all this talk online that they're just telling you, okay, you can get $1,000 the next week by doing this, it's not gonna happen, right? You have to invest time and effort in whatever you do, right? And in this one as well. But it's a good tool, it's only $10. I know I've said it too many times now, but it's only $10 and you get a lot of these things inside of it. Just have a look at one more thing. You've got computer agents. Now, computer agent is something very similar to chat GPT operator. So what is chat GPT operator? You've probably heard about it these days. It gives you some kind of a virtual machine online and then you can just give it a task such as show me available flights to Greece or find and download the image of whatever you want, right? So it is basically your assistant. It's still in the beta version. While ChatGPT operator is $200, $200. I repeat that $200, that's just too much. You get it here for $10, right? And this computer agent is gonna do whatever you ask it to do. So as you can see, just have a look at this. So it'll break this down in two steps. It'll open up the web browser, which is gonna be on the cloud. And as you can see, you can see it in action, right? So this is like a virtual machine, the computer that is somewhere else. And you see this live here. It's, it's just, it's, it's amazing what these computer agents can do. So for example, if I wanted to go to Grace, I can just put it here and I can go make myself a coffee and then I will just come back and of course, my flight is gonna be booked, right? So it's just super, super cool. It's like, yeah, having your own assistant, right? You know, secretary, you know, just book me a flight to Greece or, you know, reserve a table for two at my favorite restaurant. It's just, it's, AI is amazing. I just love AI these days. Look at it, you can see it scrolling, right? <laughs> it's just cool and it's frightening at the same time. Have a look, it goes to TripAdvisor. It's just perfect. So yeah, that's it. There's a lot of opportunities and yeah, just go and explore. Yeah, use Fiverr, use freelancing platforms and use Instagram where you can showcase your work and you know, a lot of people will naturally come to you. But yeah, just invest some time into understanding all of this if you wanna make money with this one, but it is possible. It'll all depend on you. So wish you good luck and 
I'll catch you in the next one.